Well, good afternoon and thanks for joining us here. The City Council is expected to vote today on whether or not to accept a $50,000 grant from the Ed Rochelle Foundation. It would be used to pay for police overtime in the Crosstown Agnes area. Now take a look at the map. That's the area we're talking about surrounding the old Lamar Elementary School. As we've reported, the foundation wanted to turn the campus into a new homeless shelter, but has since scrapped those plans due to opposition from neighborhood residents. Although they are not sure what they'll do with the old campus, they do still plan to move forward with their zoning request. And as Chris 6 News reporter Greg Chandler tells us, it's all part of an effort by the foundation to clean up that neighborhood. Mike, in addition to Lamar Elementary, the Ed Rochelle Foundation also bought several rundown or vacant houses around the old school. Residents here have complained about crime in their neighborhood for years. That's one of the reasons why they didn't want to shelter here. The foundation says it'll find another nonprofit to renovate the building for, but in the meantime, it's empty. I'll have more at 5 and 6. Greg Chandler, Chris 6 News.